Hello everyone, I am Anupama, third year BSc Agri student from University of Agriculture Sciences Tharwar, College of Agriculture Vijaypur. Today I am discussing about simple indigestion. Simple indigestion in ruminants is also referred as non-specific anorexia. Anorexia means loss of appetite. The term non-specific is used because there are no specific signs of illness or there are no specific symptoms. Simple indigestion is a mild form of rumen dysfunction or minor disturbance in the gastrointestinal function. Occurs most commonly in cattle and rarely in sheep and goats. The disease is most common in hand-fed cattle and beef cattle. Etiology. Etiology means cause of the disease. Any dietary fiber that can alter the intraruminal environment can cause simple indigestion. Dietary factor. Sudden change in the quality and quantity of the food. Sudden indigestion of highly palatable foods like corn and silage. Indigestible refuges. Refuges means these are the fi uh, fibrous feeds like silage and hay. And excessive concentrates. Concentrates are the feeds like energy rich feeds like grains. Animal factors. Simple indigestion is common in old age cattle. Late pregnancy and lack of water also causes simple indigestion. Drugs. Prolonged or heavy oral dosing with antimicrobials causes simple indigestion. Indigestion also caused due to feeding on plastic bags, cloths, kitchen garbage, moldy feeds such as decomposed food and sewage water. Here is the picture showing cattle feeding on garbage. A change in the diet causes change in the rumen content pH. The normal pH of the rumen is 6 to 7.5. It changes to acid or alkaline which leads to the decrease in the ruminal motility. Heavy carbohydrate produce lactic acid which lowers the pH of the rumen content. Clinical findings. Clinical signs depend on type of the animal affected and cause of the disorder. Some of the symptoms are reduction of appetite and stoppage of the food intake. Milk yield will be reduced to the lesser extent. Mild depression and dullness is observed. Affected animal stops rumination and depressed ruminal movements is observed. A firm doughy rumen without distension. Doughy rumen means uh, it is a sign of abnormality. The rumen will be uh, thick and uh, without um, it resist pressure without distension. Without distension means the rumen will not expand or without swelling. Rumen will be larger than the normal with mild abdominal pain and discomfort. Feces will be soft and whole smelling. Treatment Ruminatorics These are the oral preparations that stimulates reticulo rumen motility and appetite. Ruminatorics include herbal powders, tabs or bolus and homemade preparation. Some of the herbal powders are Himalayan Batisa, Rucha Max and Rumike. Here are the pictures. Tabs or bolus these includes Acotas, Provisac and Rumenton. Homemade preparation. It is a medicine containing Naxomica, Ajwan, Cherata, Asafoetida and Ginger. Asafoetida commonly called as Hing. All these are taken 10 grams and mixed with any of the above powders or tabs added to water and drenched. Drenched means it is administered to the animals with force. Prokinetic agents. It is a type of a drug which enhances the gastrointestinal motility by increasing the frequency of or strength of contraction. Metaclopramide and beta complex. These increases the ruminal contractions. MGSO4. It relieves constipation. 0.5 to 1 kg per adult cow is used. To correct the pH of the rumen, alkalinizing and acidifying agents are used. If acidosis is the condition, give sodium bicarbonate. If alkalosis is the condition, give 2% acetic acid or vinegar. Transponation. The process of transferring ruminal fluid containing microbes and nutrients from the healthy animals into the animal with impaired rumen digestion. Here, uh, ruminal fluid from the healthy animal will be taken and it will be transferred to the animal with impaired rumen digestion. Thank you.